Y'all remember Cam Newton's famous I'm back Well that's what Tony Jefferson reminds me of With him making his comeback to the NFL Let's read the report straight from Jordan Schultz It says Source Former Baltimore Ravens star safety Tony Jefferson is coming out of retirement And plans to play this upcoming season Jefferson has stayed in shape has been training, and wants to play again. He intends to start talking to teams in the near future after spending last season with Baltimore as a scouting intern. Tony Jefferson, you're not slick. You're not slick. And let me tell you why. Because you saw Geno Stone leaving free agency. You were with the Baltimore Ravens all last year. You saw everything that Kyle Hamilton can do. You saw everything that Marcus Williams could do when he's healthy. And you know, you know Baltimore Ravens, they need another safety right now. You're not slick. I know timing is everything. He waited too. I was like, let me wait till free agency passes and everything. Let me wait till the draft goes and everything and then see what these Ravens do. Then I'm going to come out of retirement to see if they end up signing. But anyway, now I'm just playing, man. But Tony Jefferson, shout out to him. Uh, he is coming out of retirement. Now, I do remember when there was another former Baltimore Ravens, strong safety, that had retired for a little bit and then came out of retirement, but it didn't end up going so well. That was our guy, Bernard Pollard. But Tony Jefferson, hopefully this for him, this takes a different course. Well, Tony Jefferson, he had a very interesting career. Started off as an undrafted rookie free agent and made it a long time in the league. Because some people get drafted and don't even make it that long. But Tony Jefferson made it a long time in the league. Started out as an undrafted rookie free agent with the Arizona Cardinals. Then he signed on with the Baltimore Ravens. Uh, had a nice career with the Ravens and I love it when players who started out with a different team they had some good years with that previous team but I love when they're known as Baltimore Ravens because that means when they were with the team when they were with us they shine the most and I love it but anyway Tony Jefferson he came to the Baltimore Ravens and then um he got hurt I think what he tore his ACL tore his Achilles something he had a big injury in the Steelers game but while he had that injury the play that he got that injury on he still made the play I forgot exactly what the play was but he still made the play and I was like oh yeah that's what a way to go out that boy Tony Jefferson went out like Tony Stark I guess it's a Tony thing he went out as a hero for the Baltimore Ravens but then he spent some time away for a little bit because uh, in 2019, yeah, he was with the Ravens. That the whole you remember that that Lamar Jackson MVP. But anyway, uh, in 2020, he didn't play 2020, but in 2021, he was with the 49ers. Uh, and then I guess he got cut from the 49ers. I forgot exactly what happened there. But Baltimore Ravens said, "Come on back home." Come on back home, Tony Jefferson. And I remember initially when they re-signed him in 2021, I was thinking, mm, do we really want to bring back Tony Jefferson? Because can he really cover like that? Is, is Tony Jefferson, what's he going to bring to the Baltimore Ravens? And he shut me up. He shut me up because Tony Jefferson, he showed like, oh, no, 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 no. I still got it. I'm in shape. And, and he, I forgot what game it was, but he was covering. And I was like, whoa, what Tony Jefferson is this? That man was playing lockdown defense. I said, all right, let's go, baby. Uh, but then after that, uh, he ended up going to the Giants, and that was in 2022, and he hasn't been playing since. Obviously, um, was with the scouting department for the Baltimore Ravens. But Tony Jefferson, he obviously knows this uh, from having played in the game and from being in uh, the scouting department, so he knows the game up close and personal. But the game has certainly changed a lot. Uh, and it continues to change a lot, especially at the safety position and at the tight end position, too, uh, because those are two positions that constantly go against each other uh, frequently. Um, every single game, there's battles, whether it's blocking, uh, whether it's uh, out in uh, for passing plays, tight ends uh, getting covered by safeties. So the safety as a hard hitting safety, as a box safety, I feel like they're. The role is different because you can be that, but you got to be able to do more, too. And Tony Jefferson, I'm sure he can do more, um, but more will definitely be required of him, especially in this day and age, especially how it's such a passing league. It's all about the quarterbacks and whatnot. And these tight ends, they've been going crazy more now than ever. And they are like a different breed nowadays. These tight ends. They are insane. They like receivers on steroids. Well, maybe so it be. But anyway, uh, so if Tony Jefferson is going to come back, like he's he's doing um it's going to be very very tough but i'm sure hey he knows his body and again he's been around the baltimore ravens he's been with them throughout his entirety the entirety of his retirement it only lasted about a year but he said you know what i got that itch to play again so tony jefferson wherever you end up going welcome back congratulations on coming back uh and we'll see what team he gets picked up on now something else 
Funny timing with this whole Tony Jefferson thing. Again, you're not slick. You're not slick because we talked about how with Tony Jefferson, he saw the Baltimore Ravens. They need a safety. They don't went through the whole offseason. They drafted a, a safety late in the draft. Snoozy came. They signed Bo Bray, but they don't have a clear-cut guy, a veteran guy who they could plug and play right back there. But guess what? Again, timing is everything. Who did they bring in last week for a visit? And we ain't hear nothing about Tony Jefferson coming out of retirement until now. They brought in Jamal Adams. A box safety. They brought him in for a visit. Now, all of a sudden, Tony Jefferson, you want to come out of retirement? You ain't slick, my friend.